Yo, what is up guys? I'm going to be showing you guys how to make my model chrome like color correction that I just showed. So basically, I'm going to try to make this a quick, simple and beginner friendly uh, tutorial so you guys like know like what to do and understand it. So basically what you want to do is pre-comp. So what you do is click Control shift c and then move all to a new composition. And then from there you right click, you make a new adjustment layer. And from there, you want to go to effects and presets and look up BCC colorize. Oh God, I could not type, bear with me. So uh, from there, you just drag it on the adjustment layer. And as you can see, it takes out all the color and everything, saves you a lot of time from struggling in uh, Magic Bullet looks like I used to make my own CCs. So basically what you want to do is uh, click uh, color, on, color four on, and then from there, click color three. And then I want to make this like a purple. So I'm gonna drag this like right there. I know it'll look crazy right now. I know it looks crazy, but trust me, it's gonna look nice. Trust me. So what I do, I drag this to like right here and I drag it down to a yellow because yellow looks like the best. It gives it like a little white feel if that makes sense. So I drag it like right there. So what you wanna do is just focus on these three right here, black point, white point, and squeeze. So what you want, you want your black point around like 15 to like 30, depending on like your scene. So I like it on 18 right now. Looks pretty good. And then for your white point, you want it at least like a 125 to at least like 160, depending on like your scene again. So I kind of like it like right here. And then for your squeeze, you kind of want to have it around like 15 to like 30 but I kind of like it right here in the middle of 25. It gives it a nice little feel. Oh crap. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Uh, it gives it a nice little feel. So what you also want to do is make another adjustment layer, right click, click new. And then you want to add some uh, magic Bullock. Bullock's look, so I can fucking speak or fucking speak. Magic Bullock looks. If you want to do something like this, you can add a couple of curves and then you can also go to a lens and add this if you want to give it a little bit more of a dark curve around there. So what I also do, darken it a little bit, not too much, just like that. Just a little bit more so you can make like all those colors pop, like the eyes, it looks a lot more better now. As you can see it makes it more, makes it pop, the color pop, in my opinion. So. Another thing that you can add is uh, some deep glow. Deep glow goes crazy. Make sure you guys add that to your CCs. As you can see, it already makes it pop like hell. But what I do with mine is I drop this down to at least like a little bit under 100 because I find it best for like the way I do my uh, CCs and everything. And then I drop, I raise the threshold just a bit. And then the threshold smooth just around like 65 and I don't really mess with anything else to be honest like I I used to and then I was like there's no point for it it gives it a lot more like pop to it let me go ahead and pre-comp that as you can see already gives it a nice little monochrome like color to it and another thing that I also do is add some extra curves yes I know I use a lot of curves I, I'm just so addicted to them so you just do that, raise it so like the colors are popping a little bit more as you can see it pops just slightly but it looks a lot more better, trust me. And then you can also add some flicker, or is a S flicker, X flicker is like my best friend, I swear to god I use it in every edit. 0.6, you want to change the amplitude to 0.6 and then you want to go down to the brightness to make it a 1.3 and it gives it a nice feel, a nice little like flash. If you like going for flashes like that, I'm just pre-rendering right now. But as you can already see, it looks pretty good. But uh, yeah, that's basically all that I got for you guys. I tried to make this a pretty quick and easy uh, tutorial for you guys. If you guys enjoyed, make sure you go ahead and drop us a um, sub, like this video, and go ahead and check out my Instagram. This um, project file will be available for anybody. So if you guys want the project file, make sure you just send me a DM in my Instagram saying that you know you want this project file. And um, I'll gladly send you the download link for it. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you and uh, peace out.